Okay, now we're moving on to the next section, which is introduction to HTML5 elements. Um, HTML5 introduces more descriptive HTML tags. These include header, footer, nav, video, article, section, and others. These tags make your HTML easier to read and also help with search engine optimization and accessibility. The main HTML5 tags help search engines and other developers find the main content of your page. Many of the new HTML5 tags and their benefits are covered in the Applied Accessibility section, which is much further on down the curriculum. Uh, in, this, um, in this course, we're expected to create a second P element after the existing P element with the following Ipsum text. So I just know right away I'm going to copy this silly text of per, eat, grass, rip, whatever, and then wrap the paragraphs with an opening and closing main tag. You notice it says paragraphs, so we want to wrap both of them. So the first thing that we do is we create the new P element, and then inside of it we put our text. And then around both P tags, they want us to put a main tag. And then obviously we want to close the main tag. Now when you're making HTML, well, it's good to indent things where they're in line, like this. And so once we indent this, this provides us with... Uh, good accessibility. Once you have a whole, it doesn't make a lot of sense here, but once you have a whole bunch of tags, it's good to have them indented um, correlating to which ones are within what category. Because this main and this main are correlated, we want these to be indented within them. And now we should run the code to see if it works. Ah, we did it. Thanks for watching. Look forward to seeing you in the next lesson.